Welcome, everyone, to another episode of Reincarnated as a Podcaster. We are your hosts, the Ed Boy, the Bobby J, the Forest. Look at that, man. Yeah. Look at that. Today, we are here to talk about a movie we just watched. Literally just watched it. Like, yeah, just a little bit ago, we just watched it. Um, and we watched, name. Psychopaths, like Providence. <laughs> yeah, pro- Providence. Providence. Yeah, Psychopaths, I Providence. I going to do a joke as an uh, empty theater. <laughs> No, no, uh, we'll, we'll yeah, put that joke on the thumbnail. Yeah, we'll, yeah, talk yeah, we'll, we'll talk about it. We'll talk about it. We'll talk about it here in a minute. Uh, we'll talk about it. Um, right. This I'm, is the this is fourth, the fifth, fifth, the fifth movie. <laughs> fifth movie. Sorry, After uh, three seasons and five movies, we might discuss order in a little bit later. But there's been three seasons and five movies. This is I've the seen fifth them film, all. <laughs> <laughs> and I'm, I'm still confused. I've seen ninety <laughs> percent. <laughs> this is the fifth film that we want to go watch in theaters. Mm-hmm. Um, when did this release in the? In the, in, in the Nippon? Yes. Yeah. Give me a sec. <laughs> <laughs> Last year? Last year? Okay, 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 cool, cool. Sure, cool. yeah. Uh, yeah uh-huh. Sure, I believe it. I believe it. I believe it. It's, it usually takes like six months for localization and or something. Producer, like look it up. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, whoever that is, right? <laughs> yeah, give it ah, ah. He's standing right there in the corner. Oh, uh, yeah, totally. The initial release day was May 12th of 2023. Oh, so oh. was this here? So not too long ago. Not too long ago. Cool. Okay, cool. That actually is kind of dope. And then it ca- the first viewing for the U.S. was yesterday. So we're technically mm. second viewing. That's that's probably why the theater was pretty much uh, barren. I don't know. When we went to go see uh Demon Slayer movie. <laughs> I mean, the recap. <laughs> that one was pretty empty, too. Yeah, but that was like first day. That was first day, yeah. That's what I'm wondering, second day. It, I, I think it is more of a niche show at this point. It is. Psycho Pass, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, it's on Netflix. It is. Well, it's on, I believe it well, is. Well, I think it's all on Amazon now. Oh. Let me say, uh, I'm going to ask the producer. <laughs> well, when did the original show come out? 2012? Probably. 2013. Well, this was a Crunchyroll thing, by the way. Uh, oh, it was yeah. a Crunchyroll thing? Yeah, because it popped up in the beginning, Crunchyroll. Mm-hmm. Ah, that's right. Mm-hmm. That's right. Uh, I hate when find it on Crunchyroll. I know it. Kind of was there. I own it. And then season three was not. Yeah. I also and that, own that's it. How I, that's how I saw it was your Blu-ray. So. Uh, you can watch it on Crunchyroll right now. No, it's on Crunchyroll. There you go. There you go. But Psycho Pass. Um, I mean, we've watched this since the beginning. Yep. yep. Since it started, since it came out. I would I argue. it was going to be the conclusion of the story. Same. I'd also oh, argue right. this is probably the show that I tell people that are normies that is my favorite show. It's a good. It's a good. Hey, way, it's a good place to start. Good. It's yeah, a good yeah. place to start. I, like, like I put this in my top five easily. Yeah. yeah. But you know, when you go up to some like normal stranger, you go, oh, you like anime? What would you recommend? I'll go with like you know, my dress up, darling, or you know, <laughs> or Rymo. It just seems weird. <laughs> yeah, to, you know, seems like a, oh, she's a rock. <laughs> it seems like a very strange place to start. So, uh, yeah, I go with the one with the gun. Yeah. I'm like, this is America, so. <laughs> But uh, I mean, Psycho Pass was something I always loved as as a person who loves sci fi and like uh, the cyberpunk genre and stuff like that. Great concept. Whenever I when whenever the, for the first time I watched the show, I was like, "This, this is I love this." Got a little bit of nostalgia from that late eight, like the eighties, just sci fi anime and stuff like that. I love like like Ghost in the Shell and things like this, and just bringing that back and seeing what this was is just great. I just love the show in general. And what it was. I um, was hooked in the first 30 seconds of that fight scene. I'm just like, I'm in. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, oh the, yeah. From the, like, the, 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 as the opening plays. Yeah, like, there's that whole, uh, you probably wonder how I got here. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> when you see the gun transform for the first time. Dude, that shit was bitching. Shit's great. Oh, uh, like, what the fuck? You pull it out and you're like, it becomes a USB. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, dude. But no one dies. But it has it. two modes. It has the tranquilizer. Yep. And then the, I'm a kill you. <laughs> I'm a blow you up. And then later blow seasons, you. there's like even bigger ones. <laughs> Got snipers and shit. Yep. Yeah, Dude, but it's crazy. But like the those original 24 episodes of that, like that, what you would consider that first season, are amazing. Ten. Absolutely amazing. Um, I feel like uh, quality tends to fluctuate the deeper you go. Tintu's ass. Yeah, it's not I my think favorite. it's okay. It's not my favorite. I mean, if you're gonna compare it into the grand scheme of just anime. It's not that bad. My favorite episode of season two was uh, when everyone was playing the chicken game. No. <laughs> <laughs> well, they were killing people in real life. Yeah. <laughs> that shit was awesome. I said, I think season two is okay. I think just the main character at that point, she's just so new and bitchy. Uh, it's like oh, the, the new new character. Oh, the yeah. new new character. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's what season two, I think. I, that's my diverse. least favorite character. Yeah. yeah. She's okay. 
I'd argue, yeah, probably least favorite character. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> All the Easily. other characters are kind of really good. Easily. It was like they, they gave my my girl, uh, what's her name? I kind of didn't the the main spotlight, right? Yeah. She gets promoted and shit. But then she get, also gets like put to the back. Yeah, a little bit. Yeah, and like, she's doing ooh, more important work, like yeah, you know. more paperwork. Yeah, <laughs> and then the villain is just the villain of the first one, light kind of. Yeah, the light version. Yeah, yeah, the, yeah, li- yeah. the light, the light version <laughs> yeah. of the season one villain. Yeah, yeah. Um, <laughs> and then we had what two movies, or were there movies between them? No, no. You had one, two. Yeah, and then you had a movie, movie. Um, Are you sure it wasn't a movie, movie, movie? It was a movie that was in the theaters. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I remember that. Yeah. And then there was like three overs. <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> or, or there, or there were movies, but they were stream. They were uh, released in Japan. Yeah. yeah. And then I didn't realize there was three movies until years later. And we're like, what the fuck? Yeah, where did all this come from? I don't, I don't think I, I, don't think I learned content? until <laughs> I don't think I learned until they announced like season three or se- season three was gonna be out. And then they're like, wait, there's another three movies yep. that we just never saw. Yeah, like, no one fucking said anything. They're on Crunchyroll now, I think. Yeah. yeah. Probably. Yeah. Uh, producer, look it up. I'm not <laughs> Jamie, pull it up. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not going to look it up. I don't care anymore. Um, but yeah. But then. Now this movie. You get this movie. Which which is funny because, A, I booked the theater, obviously. Yeah, yeah. When did I book it? Friday. Yeah. And today is Saturday. And I was just like, oh, I'll just book it. it you know, there'll probably be seats left. The only ones, only, only seats there were. Any seat you wanted. Yeah. <laughs> I, I showed, showed Bob, I'm like, you see, wherever X's are, those are t- seats taken. <laughs> There's no X's on the screen. <laughs> I'm like, we, I paid like 50 bucks to get a whole theater to myself. Damn. Nice. <laughs> and then like four other people showed up. But, you yeah, know. That's fine. Probably last second. Like, yeah. Hey, what's movie? Oh, oh, yeah. Watch it. Or they just found out. There's a psychopath movie. <laughs> <laughs> like, well, because I saw it on Instagram. That's normally how I find yeah, like, yeah. anime movies. But I didn't hear about it until Friday. <laughs> oh, wow. Maybe Thursday. I'm then, not, I'm but, I didn't know this movie existed until we watched it, and I was, like, pleasantly surprised. Yeah. <laughs> well, I can say it was nice to have a pretty empty theater. It was nice. So now now, now we're in this movie, right? We're, we, went, we went and watched it. Um, things you enjoyed, things you liked. Well, did you like the movie? Uh, popcorn was pretty good. They had popcorn so, this time? Yeah, the yeah. soda... I like the soda. Did you? Uh-huh. I yeah. think it could have been a little more like Spritey. <laughs> I like my own snacks. That I've yeah. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> that my uh, th- I, we're not sponsored, but these are amazing treats that you can get at your local uh, Mexican Mexican store. store. <laughs> you know, very very well recommended. <laughs> I think uh, the food top tier this time. Oh my top gosh, tier. okay. The seat was pretty comfy. Oh, it was hot though. It was, it was like leather. Yeah, yeah. I kept shifting. Yeah, 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 yeah. So the main issue, I, I was just gonna bring up the main issue with it right now. Too many commercials at the beginning. God, yeah, dude. <laughs> the, the theater says the show starts at one fifteen. Yeah. I don't know when it started, oh, but got we you. got we got home at four. Yeah. Yeah. The movie it's is gross. exactly two hours okay, with credits, and we left when the credits were on. Like, you know, so that's before, before 10 the movie, minutes they show you like the local, the local shit. Okay, one fifteen started, and there was more like local commercials, yep. more bullshit, and then actual commercials, yep. and like trailers. Your half hour of that was like trailers. a whole hour. Of it was a long it time, long dude. Fuck. It's a two hour movie. We started at one. I we got home no, at no, four. The, the movie probably that's started three at hours. Two, yeah. <laughs> we were there for. It's crazy. Anyway. Um, I like the movie. My boy came back. I'm like, yes. My girl had more of a protagonist role. Mm-hmm. The action scenes were pretty cool. The music was dope. CGI was me. I don't think it was that bad. I it was just me. Yeah, yeah. It, it's, yeah. I'd argue yeah, it's the it usual bad. like cyberpunk mecha anime look where you know they CGI it. Yeah, and, yeah. We watched it on the theater screen. It's just like whoa, it's big. Yeah, it's big. It's Noticeable. Yeah, you can. It's like, especially the one car scene when they're parking the police oh, car. Yeah. Oh. Well, that looks so shitty. You should have seen the flash. Oh. CGI on a big screen. Anyway. <laughs> 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 but no, I, just, I agree with them. It, you know, great fight scenes. Great to see all the main characters yeah, yeah. back. He pushed the girl that we all hate towards the back of the line. <laughs> yeah, like, yeah she, has, she has like three minutes of screen time. I'm like, yeah, that's all she gets. And then, but in the beginning, you meet... How uh, the white haired, he's not even in the picture. The white haired dude, uh, yeah, like the I don't even know what he is, like detective of foreign agency or something, right? Yeah, the, yeah, the foreign yeah. agency, whatever. Yeah. 
I thought it was going to be the bad guy the whole fucking time. Same. The guy with the glasses? Oh, yeah, yeah. Shindo? Same. Yeah, Shindo, sure. yeah. yeah. Shindo L, yeah. I, I'm like, dude. <laughs> I'm like, this dude's sketchy. Yeah, this guy's mm. sus. Every, every time we turn and smile at the and camera, I'm like, he's bad. He's like, and he is sus, but not not for the not for the reasons I'm, that we think he's I'm sus. Like, this, this is the main bad guy behind everything. Yeah, that's yeah. what I was thinking as well. Oh, yeah, because he was like talking to people on the other side or whatever. And I'm like, it's definitely going to be him as the main uh-huh. bad guy. He's orchestrating everything on the, the inside the puppet, but I'm like, I don't know why he's doing this, but he's got to be <laughs> very, very good. Red herring, red hair. Yeah. yeah it's a very good red hair. I'm sitting there. My own trust this guy as big as his smile is. That's as much as I trust that guy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And they try to make him look nice and stuff. And I'm like, that yeah. makes him even more sus. <laughs> he's a robot. <laughs> oh, he basically old. is basically. Yeah. yeah. And then, Let's see. What else happened in the beginning that was interesting? So at the beginning, you start right off the bat with action. Oh, yeah. You know, Cole Gamish shows up in the first 20 seconds. Popping off with real guns. Real, real guns. guns. No dominators. Like, Whoa, man. Yeah. Kicks ass. Well, he still loses. Yeah. He loses a lot. <laughs> he does. He does. He got shot many times. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I wonder, because uh, did they explain, like, healing in this universe? Is it like Halo? What do you mean? Fucking put like a foam pack and it heals your like. Probably. Probably. It's probably like, like the aliens that just like cauterize yeah. it. Yeah. Like, you're good to go. Yeah. That's what I was wondering. They got then, AI that does all of it. I don't know. <laughs> How many people got shot and it felt like everything was happening like at least in a week period? I feel like it's a little long. It might be a little longer. I think Obviously, it's longer. It, it doesn't tell you. And I mean, yeah. it's just the nature of this yeah. type of. Yeah. I just, yeah. A little fast pace, so you're probably like, oh, he's ready to go the next day. Yeah. He has to be shot three times. He's like, bam, bam, bam. He's like, okay, let's go. <laughs> like, oh, okay. But hey, John Wick. That's the thing, right, with all these type of films. Because like, it has to be fast-paced because there's so much ground it has to cover in oh, the yeah. time that it has. You think about how much dialogue was in this movie, too, that was yeah. just like, we got to keep going. Boom, 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 <laughs> Don't boom. shut up. I was watching this movie, like, this totally could be done in live action. Oh, yeah. Like, yeah. There's no way you can fuck this up. You could. Oh, uh, you could. No way you could fuck this up. You, 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 you fuck up the robots. The gun would be fucking well, like a plasma cut not, or it, something. It's not even that. I don't. <laughs> I don't think you could fuck it up visually. I think, I think you can. You might be able to, but I think personally that that wouldn't be where the big fuck up would be. Where the story. Would be. Yeah. Oh, it, it'd be like fucking Ghost in the Shell. Yeah. <laughs> Like, you look at that movie, and you're like, this could be live action, because it could. I mean, you look at almost any sci-fi anime, you can be like, this could be it, <laughs> until it gets translated through yeah. all these other writers that are are, are garbage. Yeah, uh, five, five writers in one movie. That's yeah. right, that's right, that's right. So you can do any anime into live action. Yeah, if you really want yeah, to. Yeah, look how good One Piece looks right now. <laughs> Glorious. Uh-huh. Nice of the Zodiac, fantastic. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Watch that after this one. <laughs> but... But yeah, I mean, it, it's just a solid sci-fi movie. Oh, yeah. I said I had fun. Like, I had to make sure because I, you know, I bought the tickets, wasn't really paying attention. Yeah. I was worried, like, <laughs> when Bob was there, he's like, is this a recap film? Recap <laughs> film? And I'm like, yeah, probably. <laughs> he's like, no, I'm like, I'm going to look it up. I'm going to look up reviews. And the first <laughs> review I found was a critic that hasn't seen the movie or hasn't seen the shows. This is the first thing he's ever seen. <laughs> and he's like, it was pretty good. I was confused at the end, though, with all the stuff that went out. <laughs> I'm like, you know shit, man. You there's, missed, like, there, there's 40 so hours of content to watch two. <laughs> yeah. Fuck. But then that's how I found out. It was just another I would, re- I would not recommend to just jump right into, no, this, into, into this one. No, not at all. Watch at least season one and then maybe jump in. <laughs> Yeah. You probably could. Well, yeah, yeah you probably could. Yeah, season the, two you can kind of skip because it's a recap of season one with a new character. You, you just introduce new characters, yeah. which they are in this movie. Which you'd be like, like, who are they? Yeah. But you're like, ah, I only <laughs> care about two, and that's that's all that matters. With the two, the main characters, the main obviously. Two, the main two characters. Oh, okay. I, I care yeah, about. I three. mean, it, it was the the two that freaking carried the first season. No, 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 you were missing the third one, the blonde. The blonde chick. Yeah. Oh yeah. Top tier. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Scientist lady, yeah, best character. <laughs> <laughs> but uh, it, like, it was just it was this movie was satisfying. Oh yeah, I'd from say. story to action. Yeah, I feel like it had everything that all the other stuff did, 
just as good. Yeah. I feel like just even expanding in the world building, going to a different city that isn't just Tokyo this time and yep. seeing how it's different and like uh, expand internationally. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Wow. You start you start seeing like the little threads of what the overall world building is. Right, because you get hints of it, and that's not really the main focus of season one, right? Or season one is your traditional, just like a neo noir, you know, crime thing with extra with AI, which is great. Yeah. yeah. Okay, Eddie, let's say for a viewer that's never seen this movie, never seen the show, what's like the main plot? I mean, it's like a futuristic setting. There's like an AI that rules the country. No, no, no. The AI that rules the civil system, I'd argue, or like the safety system. Well, the civil system is an AI. Yeah. Yeah, it's an but AI. But I meant not civil, civil. Oh, civil. civil. Yeah, yeah, like civil system. Yeah. Like, you yeah. know, like people, like people doing laws. They, they don't run the government so and the stuff. The AI runs the law. Yeah. The AI is the law. Yeah. They don't run money. They don't run like trades. They just deal with, and like, you know. It's kind of like Minority crazy. Report, where With, uh, they can't predict the future. For me, not. it's like it's like a weird mixture of Minority Report and Blade Runner. Yeah, is kind of what this show is with a with a with a like a a tinge of just uh, like Chinatown. Yeah, because <laughs> the the symbol system yeah. can register if yeah <laughs> can register if you're going to do a crime or yeah. might you have just bad you, thoughts. You're more prone to commit yeah, yeah. A crime in the future. Yeah, because you have a number between one and. I think it's like one in one hundred. No, well, there's higher. Yeah, but like to one hundred, if you hit more than one hundred, then you go into like rehab or whatever. Yeah, yeah, and, and then they, they, they shoot you with a tranquilizer because you're you. likely to commit or a crime. Or well, yeah, yeah. Well, they don't have to shoot you, but yeah. if you are resisting, they'll yeah. shock you basically. Yeah, 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 yeah. and then after. I, every I time it's like 200, 300. Yeah, I think it's after 200, it's like, there's no hope for you. We got to yeah. put you down, bro. Just Gun goes boom. from this to really cool, and then you, and you, you blow explode. Up. And then you explode, yeah. You blow up, yeah. The first time you see someone explode, you're like, yeah, I was satisfied. <laughs> and, and, and then, you know, they introduce the, the moral dilemma of, like, this, this other person was a victim of a crime, yeah. which altered their hue mental hue yep. which makes them more likely to commit a crime or whatever yeah but they were a victim so you know the main character is like this system is flawed yeah, yeah. and then the, the whole the whole point of the show is to show the flaws in the system where you have a villain that exemplifies that yep. by how 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 does the system deal with a psychopath that doesn't feel anything for yeah. their crimes because he well he believes what he's doing is yeah, right. right exactly yeah. yeah which is you know that's the big issue it's like yeah. if you believe you're doing right your, your can the can brain's the, gonna does be the Swiss, does, does, does the system quantify that? Yeah, yeah, and th- and that was always the big that was always because the whole <laughs> thing of this show or the whole thing of this IP has always been the idea of I, I mean it's a debate we have now especially with like the advent and how big AI is currently right yeah is the idea of like can a computer system like this run things right yeah. or replace humans in certain aspects of, of the society? Issue, the issue would be it's like would it be too strict uh-huh. not strict enough? You know, it's like, oh, you know, yeah. I stole fucking uh, a Snickers from a shop. Now I explode because my criminal. <laughs> <laughs> like, no, you just you just got to believe you really need that Snickers. <laughs> when you're hungry, <laughs> no, no, grab no, no, a not Snickers. Not even do you witness someone steal a Snickers. Oh, you don't say anything. And by proxy, you are now a criminal. Well, you yeah. don't say anything. Now you're a criminal. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Like, now you explode. You explode. <laughs> and, and that's just what this is. And what I love is it is... There's such a strong like through line and theme through season one, mm-hmm. which I think is what for me lessens season two, because it's like the same through line, yeah, just with a slightly different character. And I think it's, it's a the different point of view, though. Same. Yeah, because her point of view, like uh, the main, what, I don't remember her name, the, the main character, Akane. yeah, Akane. Like her point of view is very like. Uh, we're doing this for the right reasons, blah, blah, blah. And then she notices things change. Yeah. And she's like, oh, this isn't always right. What yeah, is yeah. controlling it? At first she was like, I got to be by the yeah. book. And the civil system is God. Yeah. And then she starts seeing the flaws. But I think, on the other hand, with the worst girl, whatever her name is. Yeah, like, <laughs> she uh, Yeah, she's very cutthroat about it. Yeah. She doesn't. I don't feel like she ever changes she's until... She's black and white. Yeah, until things get... You know, later yeah. on in some of the movies, season three, I I just feel like she's a less strong character, and because the the thing the thing that makes one what it is, I think is just is is the characters are written so strongly, yeah, because they're all written almost with a purpose, yeah. 
which you can't really say the same for, a, a, I mean, a lot of, you know, writing or products or stuff that comes out, right? And that, cause that's what makes it good, cause everything serves like the theme, the thematic question, yeah. right? Of like, is this system good? For people, yeah. Right. I think in season three she gets better, but you yeah. understand her position more. If that makes yeah, sense, yeah, no, yeah, because they do. They try to do legwork. I just feel like it's not quite the same because I feel like the the question doesn't change, but the character doesn't feed the question as interestingly as yeah. Akana does in one. Yeah, especially with the other characters being the foils that they are, whether it be the villain, whether it be Kogami, yeah. like because every every character exists to provide the necessary conflict for it to be an interesting and engaging story. Uh, yeah. I think I love specifically season one because they have, you know, the old detective guy that he was a detective prior to when the civil system was implemented in yeah. society. So he still has those old ideas of like, well, this is the traditional law and this is how yeah, we do yeah. it. And, and that's what I mean. It's just like every character serves the thematic question, mm -hmm. which is like whether the system, like I said, whether the system or law should be the thing that's implemented. And like, and, and that's, that's why it is such a powerful story near the end. Because that's what it sets out to do. And it provides an answer in its own way, right? Yeah. Like, it kind of does change because yeah. of what Kogami does, because of what the villain does, because of her experiences. And it also, it changes her worldview to the point where you get to where we are in this film. Yeah. Yeah. And um, and the this film, the reason I, I like it for what it is, is it does something similar just expanding on that territory because now it's just not, you know, this country system and law, it's uh, how is that going to affect outside of that, right? In in foreign conflicts and stuff like this as well, and is that good for the world as a whole? Yeah, yeah. I think I did like the they touched a little bit upon it when they're like, you know, we're talking about immigration and how that would affect the civil system and yes. the society and things like that. And like, mm, you know, that's a good point. Because yeah, <laughs> you got to think about it, like even in our society, obviously the world's not perfect. No. There's always issues, and we're run by how many people, and we can't get yeah. it together. It's like, yeah. <laughs> it's like that's the main issue. And then if you're trying to, because how the civil systems run, it's like what a hundred brains? I think I don't remember. A lot, a lot, it's a lot, lot of brains, yeah. too many brains, <laughs> and they're they're combined to make one like entity basically. Yeah. And they try to balance off. This is good. This is not what what's worth punishable. What's not? Yeah. And that's I think is like it's a good idea, but. Obviously, there will be flaws. No, yeah, it, like it, has its, it has its pitfalls, and that's that's the interesting of this is seeing how characters deal with what that is. Yeah, especially when you have like proxies of the system that exist, or like in this movie. Yeah, yeah, yeah. or or like uh, you know, like I said, the people or the puppets that it has to try to make sure it works. Yeah, even amongst just human candidates. Yep. Yeah, um, and that, and that's that's always the interesting about like any form of like sci-fi like cyberpunk thing is when it can ask those questions of the of the world around it because yeah. that's when it's at its best other than just the aesthetic of it um and i mean for me this movie just it it does what season one did and i like that a yeah. lot it had the characters they were still the same their viewpoints might be slightly different and slightly changed from before yeah but like akana is such a great protagonist to me because she's so like she drives so much of what happens. Yeah, she's e gung ho. Uh, even yeah. if like everything else, you could say is uh, manipulated by godlike AIs, right? Yeah. <laughs> she sticks to her conviction. Of, like, I yeah. think this is what's right. So yeah, I also think this see, movie, sorry, is also interesting because you also see Sybil itself change. Yeah, it's a uh, because. I don't know how much we want to get into right now. <laughs> oh, we'll talk about it in a few, but you see it change yeah. over the course of this movie or over the seasons. Just by her will. Yeah. Right? Just by her being like, Hey, look at the facts. Mm -hmm. Don't be like, Oh, you know, numbers, blah, blah, blah. Yeah. And, and, and I mean, that's what I love about her characters. Like, cause you, I mean, if you've watched everything up until this point, right, you watch all the events that have solidified this point for her. And you start seeing the turning point now of where it starts to affect the world around her. Yeah. And it's and it's just fun to watch. It's yeah. great. Because I said, you just see everyone change in this. Yeah, yeah. From Akane to the bitch to even <laughs> some of the background characters that you see maybe 10% in the shows. I think the, one of the points in the, that they made at the beginning of this movie was that they want to get rid of the law itself. Or like the... Was it the the Justice Department? The Justice Department in the country, because like you do it from by the civil system. We have an AI. Yeah. There's no point of having someone else appointed that does what the civil system says anyway, yep. right? 
or the Akane's point of view, like, no, we need like a mixture of both. Yeah. So that we can have like a, a cooperation between the AI and what the people want. For nuanced takes. Yeah. yeah. Um, obviously the, the hires were like, nah, it's fucking dumb, dude. Yeah. And then, and then you're dealing with that, with the idea of, well, this system works so well here. So it should be implemented in, in all over the chaos ridden world. Right. Yeah. Like every, everything should be under the system. Um, and in that, in that lawless state, right. Mm-hmm. Without that justice department, just everywhere. Yeah. Yep. It's, a, it's an interesting take on it. Yeah. Mm-hmm. It always has been. Dude, the plots were crazy. <laughs> <laughs> in this one? Yeah. yeah. I, was, I didn't see this coming. What do you think the biggest? The end one. The end one? Yeah. The end one, yeah. Okay. To me, that one's wild. I was, I was, not, was, wild. I was not expecting <laughs> yeah. that. There's, there's a few different ways that this that could have gone. That was not the way I thought it was going to go. <laughs> okay. That's fair. Yeah. yeah. Uh, I mean, I mean, the red herring that we mentioned before is, is just, yeah. it's just yeah. fun when it's confirmed not to be the case and that, you're like, oh shit. The double agent, I was like, yeah. whoa. Yeah. Well, yeah. Let's talk, well, that's what I was going to say. The double agent thing we can start talking about, yeah. which is interesting because you have the other side, which is almost like a fucking cult. Yeah, it's basically. <laughs> it's a terrorist group. <laughs> it's a terrorist cult it's group. A it's fanatical, a little, yeah, yeah. fanatical yeah. terrorist yeah. group. And they have this one guy who I guess is a double agent, which we find out obviously yeah, within maybe. the movie. Yeah. And you're just like... I didn't trust him for the longest oh, time. No, yeah. I'm like, nah, he's he's faking it. There's no way he's a double agent. Yeah. He's I gonna thought be he was trying to get inside. Uh-huh. And, yeah, and then mm-hmm. you know, shit went down because they like interviewed him, and then yeah. fucking yeah, crazy shit. Okay, let's explain. So this group has like a chip in their brain that lets the I guess the main cult guy take over take over their bodies. So even if you die, you're not dead. Until you're like Until your brain's like, like gone. Yeah. There's no like they're basically zombies. Yeah, it, it serves a it, it serves a bunch of different functions. It lets you disassociate yeah. first off. It lets someone take over, uh, and then it also makes it so that any of those negative emotions you feel gets backfed to an AI, which you don't. I mean, you don't find out till later, right? Man, but yeah. but basically backfed to an AI that takes it so that you can step around the civil system. Yep. That shit was wild. <laughs> and like, imagine someone takes over your body, and this this dude that takes over your body is like an ex Navy SEAL, <laughs> yeah, <laughs> man, with a green beret. Yeah. Well, the crazy thing is, so you first meet uh, this blonde guy, yeah, yeah. and his. Do you, uh, do you remember the other guy? His name? I don't think it ever says his name. Well, the guy, the other assassin type guy, the 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 guy that gets shot, the black dude. Yeah, yeah. the black guy. No, I didn't say his name. No, okay. I don't think it does. Yeah, Not but that either I way, like. You see them two fighting all the good guys, and then the guy gets shot in the head. Yeah. And you're like, ah, he's dead. You know, fuck that character. Yeah. He was an asshole. And then he gets up again. He's like, well, he's not. I'm not actually dead. And you're like, what the, the fuck? fuck? Yeah, what's what's like, going no on? Way, dude. And he's, he goes fucking ham on, like, everybody. Um, so of him, the doctor died, bro. There, there, yeah. there, there is one thing I want to talk about because this is interesting to me. And... Uh, I want to see what you guys take on it. Um, the, so in, the religious. No, 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 no. <laughs> I think the religious stuff. No, is involving involving the double agent, right? Uh-huh. So because what you're shown at the beginning doesn't necessarily match what he tells you later. No, I and know. The scene is the scene is done differently. Yeah. yeah. And so I I mean you know it's a wonder right it's 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 a wonder like uh, it's a question of point of view. Yeah, right? yeah, yeah. So let's say at the beginning you are in this omniscient point of view because you're watching everything as it goes down and you're shown something done in a certain way, right? Right. And then later on you have him telling his version of that story and it's not that way at all, right? I think he's just, so what's, what's reliable? I think he was just lying. I think like... I think he killed her yeah. like, quickly. I don't think it was like the, oh, let's have a little hacky oh, hacky. Yeah. Oh, it's so good to see you. Oh, yeah. yeah. <laughs> bam, bam. Yeah, because oh, that, that was always the weird thing to me. And that I think that's what solidified to me, like, the weirdness of me not trusting the guy. Yeah. Oh, when, yeah. when he says that, I'm like, but we were shown it was different. And you're yeah. saying some weird stuff. Because in my head, I'm I, like, I don't believe this. I'm like, he came in, and the other guy was, like, almost right behind yeah. him yeah. in the scene. There was no time. There, it didn't feel, look, there could have been a time cut, obviously, you can't tell but yeah. it didn't feel like that in the first no because he goes running in there and he goes pow pow right well, no, well he like, goes he disarms her uh, oh he disarms her and, and then, then you like, see he, her. he's like i said you've been waiting for me yeah 
And then you, the next scene you see and she's the dead. other guy come in and she's dead already. And he's so like, there oh, is a well, time maybe, delay. Maybe. But in maybe, my head, I maybe. think. He was supposed to bring her alive. Yeah. And the dude was like, you fucked up. Yeah. Now I gotta cut her head off. <laughs> Yeah, now I got her. You know, out. maybe, maybe, maybe it, it works is still out. A maybe it works out. Maybe it works out. But I still, it's like, it, the way that was framed. Yeah. But maybe that is also just a red herring in and of itself. Yeah. So a double. Red herring. Yeah. So maybe that's fine. Red maybe herring, it, maybe it works herring. out. Maybe it works. But that, but that's the. I think that's what makes this type of story good, right? Yeah. yeah. Like the the best part of a good like investigation like noir type thing <laughs> is the twists and turns, right? Yeah. I didn't think he was a good guy <laughs> until you know. Things happen to, to him. We can <laughs> talk about it. We're, we're at that point already. Dude, he dies? <laughs> no, he shoots himself. Because yeah. he, he commits to Doku. Because yeah. <laughs> he, you know, they capture him. And he's like, oh, I'm blah, blah, blah. Well, they don't capture him. He, He's like, I'm a double agent. But you got to, you know, tie uh, me up. I because guess it's, it's yeah, yeah. I guess we did miss that one part because then they go to track down all the bad guys. Yeah. yeah. And they find where they're at. And, you know, it's a crazy scene of them almost getting mowed down by big-ass robots with turrets. It was just, and then he comes out and just so disarms everything. There's talk about, but you should just watch the movie. Yeah. Because yeah. yeah. I know that... There's so much we're going to miss. Because Kogami fights this dude, right, without knowing he's a double agent, and he gives him a clue to find out where his base is, and I'm just that shit was the V. Dude, dude. Oh, that, that yeah. clue That's was... So, I'm sitting there like... That's pretty good clue, man. Pretty good clue, yeah. If I was that guy, but that motherfucker beat me, I wouldn't even be thinking about that. I'm like, I'm yeah. right here, I'm right here training. So this is Kogami, right? Yeah, this dude. is like this is this world's Sherlock. Like, that, dude, yeah. that dude had a chance to kill him. He's like, he says some random bullshit, throws a gun at him, and then he dips, right? Yeah. And yeah. it's like, what the fuck? That's when you start questioning things. Yeah, right? like, well, and, mm. and like I said, like the, that's what for me. The like because the, the good thing about these twists and turns is they don't really feel bullshit. Yeah, because no. because that would cheapen it, but yeah. they don't. Like if you really think about it, now that we're discussing and stuff, you're like, oh, okay, you know, this makes sense here and here. And my head that it was either going to be plot armor or he was like, get yeah. better. Yeah, yeah, yeah let's yeah, have yeah. a real fight. Oh, oh, yeah, you little bitch. The, 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 tra- the traditional like a uh, John Wick yeah, yeah. type fight where they're like, respect, man. <laughs> yeah, we'll fight later. <laughs> when he comes out the second time to give himself up, yeah, and he's carrying the body. I thought the body would be dead for one thing yeah yeah and i was like i thought you could put down the bodies you're like let's do it he trained <laughs> we're ready now let's go but no he just gives himself up then his they interview him but then uh somebody else gets hacked no he well i don't know oh yeah it's the other guy's brain gets hacked the director yeah yeah the, the guy that yeah should have died yeah, 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 yeah gets hacked then they go get his brain yeah <laughs> And then he fights back somehow. Yeah, which yeah. Nobody, well, I guess you of could. He has double chips. I don't know. No, I think he could always fight back, no. or anyone could, but uh, most of the time they're just like people just let it go. Yeah, yeah. Uh, that makes sense. So I think he's like, "Nah, this is my body. <laughs> Fuck you." <laughs> so then he, it's an interesting. Uh, have you ever seen a solo fight before? <laughs> yeah, that shit was awesome. <laughs> 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 But and that's and then, very and then, and then you get the Shindo scene where he's just like, I gotta kill you, and like all that cold blood. I'm like, dude. this guy is sus, dude. Yeah. Yeah. He's so sus. But that I do like the framing of that too, where he's just like, you know, he shot himself, so he's weakened, and then he's just like, You gotta kill me. And you just see, you know, obviously point down yeah. gun. You're like, I thought he wasn't gonna die by the um laser. The, do- the dominator. Yeah, dominator, same. Yeah. I'm like, just kill him, shoot him, I see him explode. <laughs> 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 the issue is, I at that point, if I was her, I would have pointed the Dominator at him. Well, just to well, see the, well, the, she did. Uh, she does, and it goes into the it the goes Terminator up. Uh huh. Because it changes. No, no, no. Pointed at the guy that killed. Oh, uh, Shindo. Yeah. Oh, oh it, it would have been oh, low. Oh, you right. I'm pretty sure it would have been low. You think so? Yeah. Because he was cheap. Because he's a because well, pup- he's like a puppet of the system. Yeah. No, I believe that. Yeah. But if I was in her shoes, no, yeah. I would have pointed at They're him like, because you was killed. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 No, I'd be like, you, he was clear. Yeah, yeah you right, you right. In that situation, yeah. I would have pointed at him. Yeah. I don't think she's thinking about it. And then she doesn't shoot the guy because obviously they need the stuff that's in his head. Yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> that's that's why. Yeah. Ah, yeah. I see. And then I they see shoot him in the head. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe he's good aim. He knows where the chips are, right? He's so he's like, just, if I just shoot him on the left side of the brain, then we good. We good. We good. We can still get these papers or whatever they are. To me, it's wild that they're like, we have translation chips in our brains. Yeah. <laughs> for, to, for, to work at a foreign yeah, affair dude. department. I'm like, what the that's fuck? Like, that's like the standard sci fi thing, that's right? Fucking crazy. I want that. It's <laughs> like, a, it's like, a, it's like a, the Babblefish from yeah. Hitchhiker's Guide to the Galaxy. Uh, yeah. <laughs> 
Or the app. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 We're not sponsored by them. <laughs> <laughs> but that's it. It's just fun the way things go. And, like, uh, obviously, you know, you find out the, the, the one guy isn't, you know, the bad guy. After we, after just, the fucking civil system goes and talks to him, it's like, yeah, you, you fucked up, so. We got to let you go. We got to yep. let you go. You know what that means, right? <laughs> I was just like, oh. <laughs> but they gave him the bag and, you know, he was, yeah. he was doing the fireworks scene. How, how, wait, how did he fuck up, though? What? Well, it's more like he knows too much, I think, and not everything went according to plan. I think it's because he let like, it all get out. Yeah. Because oh. I think the civil system was supposed to get those papers. Uh-huh. Yeah, but like she never cleanly. got. Uh-huh. But because this, uh, the, this, this other dude with the other AI went for him as well, it kind of it kind of fucked with things. Mm. I thought he was going to do it right there in the street. Because he's looking around. You see the fireworks. looks at the kids. Everyone's happy. And I'm like, man, he's just oh, going to blow his brains out here. I think it's because the other core that the zealot dudes are from were under him mm-hmm. and the other guy. Yeah. Oh, right, and the right. civil system's like, well, you let this get out of hand. And you involved more people that shouldn't have been involved because it should have all been on the down low. You involved the fucking snitches of the public. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> Basically, so because of that, we gotta let you we go. Gotta let you go, dude. <laughs> I think the it's been terminated. Yeah. One of the weird things about this movie was the, uh, the blind guy looking at fireworks. The blind, blind girl. The blind chick looking yeah. at fireworks. Uh, that was weird. <laughs> Yeah, that was kind of <laughs> weird. No, I thought that whole scenario between them two was very interesting to add. I didn't think it needed to be in it at all. I, I understand, I think, why it's there. I read yeah. something, and now I understand why it's there. Why? Okay, you, you want to guess? Okay. Because, I mean, part of it, uh, I mean, part of it just at the beginning is to show uh, Shindo not being as sus as you think he is at first. Yeah. And then, obviously, the brother... Um, is the double agent right? Yeah, there's yeah. a tie in there because it, it's foreshadowing. Yep. When he first mentions the the thing, the he'll come yeah. back. So yeah, it's yeah. foreshadowing for the other piece. There's a little bit of that. Uh, I mean, you get a good set dressing for speaking philosophical talk uh, yeah, yeah. in the wedding. Your, your last words. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah. You get a little bit of that to go in there and make things weird, and then you have a setup for future content with the son. Yeah. Which is season three. Oh yeah. yeah. So I, I know when you were saying, "Oh, it ties into something." I'm like, "Oh, that's where she's from." I knew her from yeah, something. I, so okay, I, I, this movie comes before season three. Oh. That's where oh. the son of Shindo is the main character yeah. in season three. Yeah, oh. he becomes a uh, fucking cop. Yeah, yeah, and he's the main character. Oh, okay, 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 okay. That makes sense. I forgot then. about that. Yeah, yeah. that so, makes okay, sense. So it, all, it all, it all, it all ties, it all ties in. in. It all ties yeah. in. Like uh, I said, it, it, like it's pulling, it's pulling multi duty in the 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 way the story is set up. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> Like okay. season three didn't do us well because it's fucking shitty. We're gonna well, fix no, it. No, season three is not <laughs> shitty. It's just on a platform no one knew what came out on. I think was more of the issue. I also have eight episodes. Yeah, That's it's very short. Well, they're one hour episodes though. Oh, they are. I think they they're might long. Be, yeah. Holy shit, they're long episodes. Because I, I remember, mind. I remember when it first came out, we were talking about it, yeah. and they were hour long episodes. Holy I shit. didn't mind it. The only thing I had issue with season three, it felt very disjointed from the rest. You're like, Connie's in jail. What the fuck? <laughs> I don't even know if they talk about that. She's in jail. She's in three. Do they fully talk about it? Yeah. Okay. I well, just they don't remember. tell you why. That's true. Oh, weird. This movie. <laughs> weird. Okay. Yeah, now I'm putting a lot of pieces together of season three. This yeah. makes more sense now. I understand these are really kind of good. You're like, ah, this yeah. movie was not only good, but it made this other season that I didn't think was as good be kind of good. I was just kind of confused. I just thought it was like disjointed stuff. I'm like, yeah, yeah. weird. Okay. Uh-huh. I don't know why we're here, but we're here. That shit's wild, dude. Okay. Now, you know, season know. three. Oh, you know, I, I, think it's, I think it's the issue of uh, like when you think about uh, the television versus movie that happens in anime, right? Yeah. Um, a, a big example for me, I think, is if you watch like Fake Grand Order, where like Babylon came out and uh, before Camelot did, even though Camelot's before technically yeah. <laughs> and stuff like that. And it's just that thing that happens, right? When you announce a film and TV, the TV one's going to come out first. <laughs> Always does. Always does. <laughs> Compared to the film. And now this is probably the case where season three was made. Yeah, but that was, was like fucking before. like four years ago. Maybe this movie's been in, in, in production for a while. Cold may have fucked it up. Probably. Yeah. Season three came out 2019. Yeah. 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 I remember watching it because I had... It was like I had weird downtime. Yeah. I'm like, oh, I'll just watch this. It was like way after it came out. Maybe this was supposed to be a 2020 movie. Uh, maybe, yeah. Maybe. 
Who knows? Who knows? We'll <laughs> never know. But yeah, dude, that plot twist at the end. <laughs> <laughs> what plot twist? Uh, where, so, you know, Shindo dies. He commits suicide. And he's like the public. What is his role? He's like Dur- he's a director of something. He's, he's like, another he's director. He's like high ranking in the yeah. government. It's more everyone's a director if they're not shooting people. Is what I've learned. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> and civil system wants Akane to be the to be new him. Yeah. yeah. He's like, oh, she. It, it's like you're gonna be the main of everything because yeah. you're already not listening to us. So yeah. fuck it. Like you you go do your shit. Been doing. You found out. Basically, yeah. we're gonna we're gonna force you to be our puppet. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. This is the path you're walking on now. And then she's like, nah. <laughs> she's like, nah. nah, fam. I ain't about that life. Pew, pew. I have my beliefs. I have my belie- yeah, dude. Okay, so she's about to get presented in front of everybody, her new position as a high-ranking officer. No, player. I think Official. it was retirement. No, no, no. It's promotion. Is it promotion? Yeah, because it says it's a decoration ceremony. Oh, I thought it was a decoration. No, because like, it's it, no, no. It's no, no. it's like same times. It's the same like congrats. And like thank you for being an like a an inspector yeah. or whatever. But now we're promoting you oh, to yeah. Because I thought she wasn't because the last line before she gets the promotion was I'm not going to be part of your thing anymore. As in, I took that as she's leaving. Because mm. that's what she said. She's like, I'm not going to be part of civil anymore. And well, it's I think mean, that's like after the, promo, the like the promotion. Oh, sorry, not civil. I'm not going to be part of shit. What's the exact term? It's like the civil system. Civil. Yeah. Not civ- well, no, because no, because she says she's not going to be a part of it anymore because she made her choice because they offered her that position, and so she was going to take that position because that's the one she needed to enact whatever she decided to do because uh, she wouldn't have been able to do it without that. Yeah, yeah of course. Yeah. So it's like you know the main officer person of the the fucking whole country i guess yeah. yeah she's like look at here this is a war promotion and she's like nah <sighs> fucking shoot with a real gun a <laughs> real gun <laughs> and then they everybody. and then they scan her right to see if she's you know and nothing she's clean. Not clean she's at 60 which is high as she's yeah. ever been obviously because yeah. yeah. she's but still like yeah. not enough to take so i think in the first like movie or show she's like fucking like, like one to like, ten yeah like it's like, it's like low i think it gets kind of, it gets higher at the end of season well one, yeah because she learns a lot yeah she goes through learns, all the yeah you learn the main character well, not the, enough to be a criminal yeah you yeah. learn about the brains you learn the, the <laughs> main you learn so much shit yeah. at the end. you learn the main fucking uh Judge the white, uh, the old oh, lady the, is the a director, robot. The, yeah. Yeah. He learned so much, and she's like, "I don't know what to do here." <laughs> okay, <laughs> I'm going crazy. I'm just gonna obey the AI for a bit. Because yeah, they try to put her in uh, the rehabilitation. Remember? Yeah. And then she kind of says, "Fuck that." <laughs> she just keeps doing what she's yeah, doing. She killed the officer in front of everybody. Get scanned. No, she's clean. Nothing, nothing to do here. And all the news anchors are like, yeah, like well, dude, we all saw her kill this bitch." But I was like, saying it's not like, like just any officer, right? It is that. It is the robot. The it is the yeah. It's the robot. It's basically the voice of the civil system. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. But in their point, or like people's point of view, is because I don't think they knew she was no, a robot. No, no one else. No, no one knows. They just saw her kill yeah. the fucking main the like main person, person of the whole fucking structure. And then the news anchors are like, oh, my God, they scanned her and she was clean. How is this possible? Blah, yeah. blah, 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 blah. Because all the other times where they've had things like that's always been swept under the rug. Yeah, they're yeah. just like, it's just, just a criminal. Like, the, <laughs> like the, the villain from the first season or the villain from the second season. <laughs> they swept under the rug. It all swept under the rug. You can't sweep this under the rug. No. <laughs> it's, it's invisible. And, that's kind of the, and I think that's the point, and that's yep. why she took the position, because yep. she could make it. Public a, a, a statement yeah. against civil system. And then our boy becomes free. Boy becomes free, yeah. And she goes to jail. And she goes to jail. They switch places. Yep. <laughs> is he, very not, is nice he not in season three then? Uh, partially, I so. but I, haven't seen all I, of it. I don't remember what he does if he does anything. Oh, I can't remember. I it, it's only seen, been like three season, years. I haven't seen season three, so I don't. It's been three years, and I said it wasn't like the best of all the seasons until this movie came out. Oh, so <laughs> it's like a story of all the mi- back background characters. Yeah. 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 Yeah, you learn a lot. Like all the all the characters you see in this movie for like ten minutes, they're all the main oh, characters. Okay, okay, okay. Because okay. yeah, you learn about the hacking dude, the fucking other dude that likes the other girl, which is wrong. But you know the other chick that gets added. Even learning about the fucking smoky lady. Oh, oh my boy, my my boy Gino is yeah. still there. Yeah. Yep. Dude, I think these are all the new people though. Dude, when yeah. Gino just killed that bitch with like with his one arm. Yeah. Oh, wow. I forgot he had a robot. Yeah, so did I. <laughs> I'm like, he's, he's gonna so blow. Yeah, look at that. And then the arm comes off, and I'm like, 
Oh yeah, that's right. <laughs> I thought, I'm like, he's gonna blow up. Oh no, not my boy. No, yeah, but dude, I that, forgot that, he had a robot arm. Was a great statement. Yeah. It was good. And like I said, and like overall, like over the course of all of that is psychopaths. That's why for me, like Akana is just such a great yeah. like protagonist because you you see the through line. The character arc is just beautiful. Da Vinci. I guess we, we, we did skip like the main main battle scenes, but you know, yes. because you know the main stuff at the end was they do go because the civil system's like just give them the papers, let them be their own shit. Well, we'll figure no, it out later. They're gonna, they're, they were going to join the civil system, yeah, yeah. eventually, yeah. eventually. But as I said, let, let them figure out their own shit. They'll come to us yeah. at some point. And she's like, "Nah, fuck this shit. I'm we're going doing in. It now. Guns are <laughs> blazing. Like, nah." I'm gonna make a statement now. We gotta make them pay for their crimes, and they're like, "Yeah, all right." You got fucking <laughs> starships flying, doing barrel rolls. No, that's why. It was the action of it. The it was great. The light in the stratosphere. Yeah. The laser. It, go, it goes on Mission Impossible. After. Yeah, that shit was crazy. but you have the. I guess the big thing that we didn't talk about was she is talking to the god or the guy who thinks like all oh, this is gods, yeah, like yeah, the yeah, pointed yeah, yeah. thing. Tona, tona, yeah. yeah, she gets shot. The, obviously, the gun didn't register at the time, which yeah. I thought the gun would register after they hacked everything, but we never got to see that. No, it probably would have. Yeah, because I think his brain Why would've. did she fucking put the cuffs on her hands? She didn't. Uh, he did. He did. He, did? Yeah. Oh, okay. he cuffs her. Yeah. Uh, and like, then, Why'd you cuff yourself, girl? No. Yeah. <laughs> she gets shot in the leg. Shit and goes the, down. And, the yeah. and then the stomach was after. Yeah. Then you know the guns point to his head or her head, but she throws the key where all the papers were to make him yeah. a thing into the yeah to, uh, to force it. Yeah. So shit happens in this movie. <laughs> it's like this. It's like a legit USB. See, dude, that one. Scene <laughs> I do. She, I she the has a big ass cannon like that, and you and she, just one shot. <laughs> yeah, yeah. The 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 magnetism shot yeah. basically. It's one shot only. That's all it took. I'm just happy they killed the Jesus. The Jesus Believe dude. Yeah, 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 yeah. Fuck that guy. Yeah, Cole got me again. Just bullet to the head. So, what are you going to rate this? 9.5. 9.5. I would like this movie. That's really high. I was going to say 9, though. I was going to say 9. <laughs> like, uh, within the grand scheme of everything that is, even even outside, I think it's just a good film. Oh, yeah. The Ocean Gate reference was top tier. Oh, my Lord. <laughs> 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 I think this movie is great. I said, this movie is so good. That the reviewer who's never seen Psychopaths gave it like an eight. Yeah. So, you know, yeah, it's gotta be really good. Because it is a good movie. Like, even, I think, even if you don't fully understand everything that's going on with what you f- do see, because yeah. it does give you enough and it is standalone enough that you're like, you can get a good picture of what everything is. Yep. There's some moments that you're not gonna, you're just not gonna understand because there's baggage, but you do get the main gist of what the story is from the get go. Yeah. They do give you the the text of like in this society, you know, this, everything's run by the civil system. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. It gives that you text enough. Was a little too quick. Oh yeah, <laughs> I, was like, I read half of it. Yeah, yeah, it's gone. I was like, I mean, there but the thing is, like, it gives you enough where this does feel like it can be standalone. Oh yeah. In the grand scheme of what it is, and then it's just amplified by knowing what comes before it. Yeah. I think if you're just a, a, a normie, a random person watching this movie, and you're like sci-fi, I might shut my brain off. Thousand brains, nah, whatever. Why would Fuck. you? Why would you shut your brain on? Because <laughs> you're just like, whatever's going on. Yeah, it's like, going hey, on. You're like, it just you're like, it's a sci-fi thing, right? Yeah, it just you, works. you see guns and you're like, I'm here for the action. Yeah, <laughs> I'm here for the pew pew. Yeah, you'll be amazed that the action's really good. It's very and good. the it's talking yeah, it's, actually it's makes good. a lot of sense. But it's brilliant, and it, it just reminds me how much I love this series. Yeah, I said this was a nice like pick me up since the last two seasons weren't like. Great. Uh, yeah, I wouldn't say they're not like ten out of tens, but I heard the Elvis are, are pretty like good. Sevens. Yeah, the Elvis stuff is pretty fun. Yeah. Yeah. It's all fun stuff. It's yeah. not like super additive, but no, it's just more it, world it's building. Yeah. yeah, it's more world building. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. or to give you more background on the characters. Yep. Yeah, the third one is kind of uh, tie. It ties things together. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. That's when you see what's the. It, that's cool the first there. one that comes back. Every everyone comes back, right? Yeah, that's the. Yeah. On the third one is like. When it, when he comes back yeah. to set up this movie. Yeah. Sweet. Yeah. But yeah, watch it. Watch, yeah. it. watch all of it if you haven't already. And, and if what you, are you doing? What are yeah. you doing? If you've already seen it, you just wanted to hear us talk about it, tell us what you thought about it. And yeah. if you say it's not a nine, we'll come to your house. We'll find you. We'll find you. <laughs> we'll use that dominator on you. Pew, pew. pew, pew. pew, pew. Hopefully we get a better one. Thank you, everybody, <laughs> for watching. Don't want a real one. <laughs>
Do you really want a real one? Oh, no, like Dude, I want the replica. Size. I want the replica yeah. with the face recognition and the transformation. I should have bought it the one time it was at you fucking should've. AX. It you was should've. at AX really? when I first went. Because that company was there. Yeah. How much was it? 1,000. Yeah. Holy shit. But it that transformed. Badass, it though. registers your face. Yeah. Like it, it. Like if I point it at Eddie, it would change. Like I could program it to change. Yeah. But if I point it at you, I could program it to not change. Yeah. And it'd be like, oh, here's there's like thing, an app blah, with blah, it. Blah. It did all the no- like the voice lines and everything. Yeah, that's badass. Because the same company makes like a uh, remote control, the freaking Spider Mex from like standalone complex. Uh-huh. Yeah. Yeah. They make they, those. They too. make those as well. And they made them like their um, Alexas almost. Yeah. Holy oh, shit. Yeah. Awesome. Hey Alexa, subscribe to Reincarnated as a Podcaster on YouTube.com. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> we'll see everybody next time. Bye. Peace.